Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. I hope you're all thriving. Today's vlog is special as we are hitting the streets of Ottawa, the capital of Canada, and also reconnecting with our friends. Let's go. Paused for a little bit at an on route. Now, on routes are like stopping points for travelers commuting between major cities in Ontario. A bag of baked goodies and date balls my friend prepared and gave us the day before. We were happily munching on it. So, at Ottawa, we will be staying with our friends Kartika and Nakul. They also have two pet dogs. Honestly, I was anxious because I was never used to growing up with pets at home. So fingers crossed. So as expected, when we arrived at the door, the dogs came running to express their excitement. I stood outside until they were away from the door. Nakul did the needed and I got inside and grabbed the tallest seat available and did not move from there for like the next 20 minutes. It's the next day morning. Nakul is making breakfast for all of us. We decided to head downtown to Ottawa for the day, just a chill outing to explore, maybe grab some food and soak up the city vibes. So 
as we were strolling around the city, it was quite interesting to see that they had these steel panels set into the road, which included information about significant events, dates related to the Baywad market's history. Byward Market is a charming and vibrant neighborhood. One will find an array of stalls, cafes, and lively restaurants. If you love browsing through stalls, be sure to add Byward Market to your list of must visit when in Ottawa. The Parliament Hill has three main parts, the Centre Block, East and West Block. Another cool thing to know that the flag that you see on top of the Peace Tower is being changed every day. It is a daily ritual that takes place year-round regardless of the weather conditions. Also, you can get on the waitlist to receive the flag that has been taken down, but the demand is so high that waitlist is more than 100 years long. Insane. Now we are on a hunt to find a secret bar that we know is located in the Spark Street. We know the name, but there's no direct entrance and no signboards anywhere. We stopped at the Rabbit Hole restaurant, ordered a drink and inquired with the bartender about this hidden location. We were then asked to wait here until a host escorts us to the speaky sea. Thank you for watching. See you next time. Take care. God bless.